Police in Clearfield County say a team of burglars who lured a woman out of her home, then robbed it, tried again at a nearby house. Devin Clark has more on that. They pretend to be construction workers. Uh, two individuals, they're using a distraction method. One will distract the homeowner and uh, another person will, will break into the home. Police believe the same team of burglars that lured a woman out of her Sandy Township home last week, then used walkie-talkies to communicate as they stole coin collections, may have tried to hit other homes in the area. I had an individual come uh, stop at station today and he reported to, uh, basically a uh, suspicious male that uh, fit the description of the mail that we released uh, on Friday. This time, police say the suspects backed off. They believe it's because they saw the potential victim was a male, and police believe the criminals are targeting elderly women who live near commercial buildings. It's happening uh, in the area of businesses where uh, people don't question why they're there. If it, if it was in a residential neighborhood, everybody pretty much knows their neighbors. They become a little suspicious on people that new people that show up in their area. Police say the suspect who knocks on the door is a white male, about 5'8", 180 pounds, possibly in his mid-30s with dark hair. But because police aren't giving a description of the other suspect or suspects, they want everyone to be aware of suspicious activity around your home. Strange vehicles, um, strange people in their neighborhood if, if they're around. And I don't know too many too many companies or too many contractors that go around alerting the neighborhood that they're going to be making noise. Devin Clark, 6 News.